Hey guys, it's Kevin Kreider, and in this video, I wanna share with you how ketogenic diets have changed my life. Firstly, I wanna claim that I am not on a ketogenic diet right now. I am not an advocate or an activist for ketogenic diets. I do find they have great benefits. You can see a ton of benefits through a lot of research, such as helping out in cancer patients who go through chemotherapy and it actually reduces cancer cells and tumors. And it also helps with neurological disorders. So I am not discarding any of that. It's just that right now I had some great realizations with ketogenic diets when I was doing it a long time ago. And I wanted to share with you what I came across. The biggest things that I've noticed from a ketogenic diet was that when you get rid of sugar, refined sugar or just sugar, you just feel better. A lot of people are gonna say like, well, you get a keto flu when you do this and get rid of sugar and we get rid of carbohydrates and then you gotta get ketone sensitive, which probably some of that's true. But what I find is that when I reduced that, yeah, I felt groggy and I felt like a little bit like phlegm coming up and a little bit sick of that keto flu they're talking about. But I also had that when I actually got rid of sugar in my diet, I felt very lethargic and tired, and it felt like the same symptoms. And then I, rem I remember reading this book by Tim Grover and the way he would test his trainers out to see if they were disciplined and have what it took mentally, physically, and just telling them the truth on stuff, he would actually make them go on a zero sugar diet. Zero sugar, no fruits, no refined sugar, no sugar, period. And if they came back to him in about a week and they were like, yeah, this diet's okay or it's not bad, he'd fire them or get rid of them because he was saying that when you get rid of sugar like that, it is so such a shock to the body. You feel run down. You don't think you can do it. There's flu-like symptoms, all of that kind of stuff. So I had very similar but less intense because refined sugar wasn't a huge thing that I had every day. But there were times that I binge on sugar and obviously the next day I'd feel like crap. But the thing is, I wasn't eating sugar that consistently where I got an extreme flu-like symptom. So that was one of the biggest realizations with a ketogenic diet that I came, that it was just really the amount of refined sugar that we eat that makes us feel lethargic or bad. Remember when I was on more of a no refined sugar, no dairy, I had the same feeling that I got when I was on a ketogenic diet as opposed to that as well, just getting rid of dairy and refined sugar. So that was really it. That really changed my perspective in life when it came to nutrition from a ketogenic diet perspective. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel, and I'll see you guys soon.